Company Atmos is asking a judge to rule they were not responsible for the explosion at the Sandman Signature Hotel in Fort Worth. The blast there injured 21 people three weeks ago, and tonight Atmos is suing the hotel's owner. Teresa Woodard is in the newsroom tonight to bring us up to speed. Teresa, there have been a lot of lawsuits filed in this case. Yes, yeah, Cynthia, that is part of the issue here. Atmos says nine lawsuits involving 33 people have been filed against them, and they say no one should be suing them because they claim they're not responsible. And tonight, Atmos is basically asking a judge to declare that publicly. They claim evidence will show the gas leak that caused the explosion was inside the hotel and not on any of Atmos's lines. So Atmos wants a judge to declare that its system did not cause or contribute to the explosion and to declare it not liable for any damages. There's more. Atmos claims the hotel owner has, quote, little incentive to protect or preserve evidence. So it's asking for a temporary restraining order to keep the hotel owner from messing with any evidence until at least the end of March. And finally, Atmos is asking to be allowed onto the hotel property so it can do an inspection of its own. Now, it was January 8th, three weeks ago tonight, when the hotel exploded, injuring 21 people, four of them critically. While Atmos has publicly said its lines were not responsible and now repeats that in this lawsuit, a Fort Worth Fire Department investigation into the exact cause does remain open. Tonight, it does not appear a date for a hearing on Atmos's lawsuit has been set.